Hello, welcome to a video, a mini video. Now today's mini video is about the second Jurassic World Lego set which I built. The Quetzalcoatlus plane ambush. The only reason this is going to be a like very short four minute video is because uh, while building it my camera may or may not have had too much storage on and didn't film all of it and stopped halfway through and deleted everything I had previously already ha filmed. <gasps> but there were three bags of Legos and I decided to wait and build the Quetzalcoatlus last. So we are at least going to uh, build that. I, uh, oh, these are extra pieces. I will throw them over here with the others. We do have the plane. The plane is built. We have our three main characters of this lego set not to mention the huge mahosive quetzalcoatlus i'm probably saying the name wrong but i don't care you will get over it quetzalcoatlus i think it's quetzalcoatlus is how i used to say it and that's how i say it now because i am a respected adult teenager i pay taxes now, it's Quetzalcoatlus. I am actually really excited. I, I, I am like, ah, oh, ah, oh, ah. Oh. oh my gosh, it's so good. I love it. Let's hear this. Oh, that's some good cracking. Let's throw that wing in. Ah, oh, this bird is absolutely huge. It's Big Bird. I can put two minifigures on it. They can fly. Oh, look at that thing. It is absolutely humongous. I can move the wings up. I can move them down. I can even do this now. I can move them forward and back. Oh, hold on. There we go. I can move them forward and back. Not to mention make it yell at minifigures like... Oh, I love this thing. This is so cool. Look at it. Look at it. Look at the head. It has an evil eye. And this cool thing on the roof of its head. I love it. These are all brand new pieces. New Lego molds. I love it. Look at the wings. Look at how wide it is. Okay, so you compare the wing the wingspan of this bird to the wingspan of the plane. Look, look at this. Look at it. The plane is just a little bit bigger. It's huge. I love it. I'm going to make it hover over these guys. Oh, look at that. That is so cool. Of course, we have another Owen because Owen is apparently the best and you need him in every Lego set. We have a Kilowatts, the uh, pilot -o. And... Yes, she does have a second face. I can't tell if it's focusing or if it's just dark. There's her second face. There we go. And then her first face. I'm not a huge fan of the hair piece, but it'll work for her Lego figure. And then, of course, we have our first Claire. I, um, if you want to see the double head of Owen, go watch the other video because I'm not showing that. But Claire does have a separate face it's basically the same as the 2018 lego sets but yeah they're basically the same um now about the plane i'm actually going to smush these guys all the way in the back for this kayla stand up stop falling over you're a good guy in the movie i only knock over the bad characters so, the plane. <laughs> Where do I start? Where do I start? Um, wingspan big. Big wingspan. Plane big. Plane big. It, it, it roll on wheel. It, it nice. Engine blade spin. And then they can also be broken off by the Quetzalcoatlus. Like in the trailer. Which is really cool. 
and then you can just put them put them back on like this you like yep just just like that and put them back on and then do it again or just break one of them off it's really cool i love it you can of course sit all three people in here the pilot owen and kayla we know kayla is the owen claire and kayla you can fit them all inside and then the back here has a little hatch that opens up and there's a little bit of a toolkit in here which if i get out it has a flashlight a wrench flashlight a wrench and a fire extinguisher and then you can just slide that right in there like that and it fits perfectly you can even push it forward a little bit if you need to and if you push it in far enough where you can't reach it you can always open up this top bit reach in there grab it and pull it back but that is like pretty much it for this it's an awesome build it really is i enjoyed building it a lot i just wish it would have been a longer video but hey what can you do you gotta you gotta make do with what you have Here's the Quetzalcoatlus. I am going to pause the video just for a moment, though. I grabbed one of my Lego Tranodons. You can always tell if they're authentic, authentic Lego if it says Lego on the studs on the back. Which it does. Even though it has fake wings and the fake head because they're hard plastic. But I took fake Legos and put it on the real Legos because my real Legos were getting old. This is a 2016 Lego, so it's very old. But, just look at the size between the Pteranodon and the Quetzal. It is absolutely humongous. So, yeah, it's, it's very big. It is absolutely huge. It is the first big bird I ever have. And probably will ever have, because I do not plan on Lego making any more of these giant Quetzalcoatluses. But, hopefully they do, because that would be awesome. But then again, that just means more money, which I have to give to complete my collection, which I am trying to do, because I have every single set from 2016, and 2018, and 2019, and 2020, and now 2021. Wait, no, 2022, and 2021. Oh my gosh, there was a lot of years in between. Fallen Kingdom and Dominion. But, yep, that's basically the end for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Okay, bye. That was not a proper outro. Thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed and you want to see more, hit the like button so I know that I can buy more Legos and do more reviews. Hopefully my phone has enough storage to do the other videos, or at least let me do a speed build or a speed montage of me building them. Because unfortunately you don't get to see me build this one because my phone was too full. But yeah, that's the end of this video. The Quetzalcoatlus is going to fly the plane out of here, and we will see you next time. Bye!